I bet the eclipse will be one of those things where like once you finally see it though, you'll you'll just be like, okay, oh. that's cool. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> oh that is so nice. All right, so it is Monday, August 21st, early morning, solar eclipse day, which is very exciting. And actually, first of all, I don't think I actually showed my face here on this YouTube channel before, so hey. Um, it's definitely a little weird doing a vlog style video because I usually do tech videos, but I do kind of want to try something new. Um, but anyway, the plan right now is to drive up to Nashville uh, to see the solar eclipse because Nashville is actually, I think it's the only sort of big major US city that's in the path of totality of the eclipse. So definitely that's the ideal spot for me. Um, so I'm gonna pick up my buddy later to drive over there. It's about a three hour drive from where I am right now here in Tennessee. So that'll be pretty fun. And anyway, so yeah, this is a tech channel. So I'm gonna show you some of the gear that I'll be bringing to help photograph and take videos of the eclipse and just sort of capture my day. Um, so yeah, so here on my table, it's kind of a bit of a mess, but here is some of the gear that I'll be bringing with me on my little day trip. So here I have my 15 inch MacBook Pro with Touch Bar, which I'm just gonna be using to edit some photo and video uh, when I have time available. Um, anyway, and then I also have here the hyperdrive adapter sort of dongle because the new MacBook Pros don't have an SD card slot anymore. So which as for me as a photographer, that's a very important thing I need. Um, but anyway, and then over here, actually recently, uh, pick this up. This is the Lassie Porsche Design 2TB hard drive. Um, I looked at the 2TB SSDs from Samsung, but those are just way, way expensive and out of budget right now. Um, Alright, so here I'm going to be bringing some, you know, some earphones. These are the Beats X. Um, so while we wait for the totality of the solar eclipse, I just want to listen to some music to chill a little bit. And then, of course, I got these two battery packs right here, portable batteries. One of them is 10,000 milliamps and the other is 12,000 milliamp hours. And these are from a company called PowerAd, which I've been using for years now and they're very reliable when it comes to battery packs. So I've been using them. And yeah, so that'll keep me powered throughout my day to keep my gear all uh, juiced up. And the mouse I'm not gonna take with me, but of course it is solar eclipse. So I, knew, I do need solar eclipse glasses. And I actually picked these up last minute. Um, they're all sold out in stores, so I actually went on the Facebook Marketplace, which is like this new sort of Facebook thing where it's kind of like Craigslist, but it's on Facebook. Um, but yeah, anyway, I picked those up for like $5 each. Um, yeah, that's the uh, price you pay for doing everything last minute. Um, but yeah, I did check that these were not fakes. These are 100% genuine, which a lot of people were ordering these online and they were ending up with fakes, so they were really pissed off about that. And of course, it's Nashville. It's going to be hella hot out, so you need to keep hydrated bring a water bottle and I'll probably be in, bring an extra one because that's not going to be enough for an entire day. Um, and I'm going to be wearing my Apple Watch for the entire day also. And then I'm going to bring my tripod to do some time lapses and capture photos of the eclipse. And in terms of actually taking video and um, photos of the eclipse, I have to be very careful because I can pretty much melt my camera. So I have to be careful about when and how I do it because you actually need a special filter when taking pictures of the sun, which I don't have. So I'm gonna be very careful about that. And yeah, so that's pretty much all my gear. And then, oop, right here, of course my camera bag. I got a bunch of different lenses I'll be taking with me as well. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna pick up my friend and we're gonna head up to Nashville very shortly. All right, so right now I'm heading over to pick up my friend, Show. That's Show, minus a W, add a U. Um, and right now, classic me, I am late. I set us behind 30 minutes behind schedule. And I need to get go get gas, so. Did you forget? Introduce yourself for everyone. So, cool. All right, so three hour drive there, and I'm just gonna start a time lapse right now. All right, we finally made it to the Parthenon in Nashville. It took us a, quite a while to find a parking spot. But show here is carrying the lawn chairs. So, and then I'm bringing my tripod to set up the camera. 
hopefully we can get some good footage and photos of it. But yeah, there's a lot of people here and they're pretty excited and there's a little bit of cloud so hopefully it's not covered, but we'll see. So we finally got everything set up here. Um, so over here, I got my camera set up on my tripod right there. We got our lawn chairs, got my glasses, and then shows just texting. Everyone here is getting pretty anxious to see the totality, um, but yeah. So so far, it's pretty hard to take photos because it's pretty bright out, and I don't have a filter. The glasses look stupid. Yeah, the glasses, they look pretty stupid wearing the glasses, so... But hopefully, the clouds won't cover the eclipse once it happens. Um, but, we'll just have to wait. It's gonna happen any second. Beautiful.